What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy OGTMANE, aka the main event. And today, we got another video by Rainco titled Jack Doherty Finally Got Humble. Now, I don't mean to hate on no, I'm not even gonna say I don't mean to hate. I don't even like hating on people unless it's a good and valid reason. But this dude right here, I can make the exception. Like, when I tell you, whew, it's just, mm, like I said in the last video, I just hate dickheads, you know? Just, just hate people like that. But, um, without it being said, enough talking, let's get to the video. In economy? Dude, for real? Bro, I thought you were rich. Man, y'all really hate Jack Doherty. I did not realize that until last video. Good lord. Take a look at this man's search query. Jack Doherty gets humbled. Jack Doherty in economy. Jack Doherty leaks. Jack Doherty knocked out. Like, damn. Jack Doherty banned. Jack Doherty on plane. Like, y'all are on this man's dick, bro. It makes sense why he's rich now. Apparently, people are on the lookout for Jack Doherty's downfall. And listen, I want to see a Jack Doherty character development arc. Like, imagine all of a sudden, it just turns his whole life around and then puts his full attention to the Lord and Savior. Jack Doherty has a sneako arc. He goes Muslim. Somebody said, Jack Doherty moves to O Block and gets beat up is what we all need right now. Like, damn, y'all are preying on this man's downfall. Anyways, Jack Doherty's newest humiliation ritual just dropped, and this time, bro's flying on spirit. And I don't know, flying on economy is fine, but you know what they say, bro. I mean, if you fly spirit, you turn into a spirit. Actually, it looks like he's on Delta. Why are y'all saying he was on spirit? I always dodge spirit. I always avoid the Boeing planes or whatever those crash out planes are called. Boeing 787s. No, thank Thank you. But this time, Jack Doherty decided to test his waters with his life. And in the process, there was another person on board with him that wanted to just humiliate him. And I still don't know if this is staged or not on Jack Doherty's end. He might have just hired somebody to just film him or had a bro there. But it looks kind of real. It might be a real fan. But anyways, like the video, bro. Subscribe so I can beat the falling off allegations. Let's go. Doherty and economy? Dude, for real? Bro, I thought you were rich. Like, you're in the middle of the seat, the back of the plane. Like, what's going on? He's saving money, bro. Go, get off the plane. Runs down bad. Runs down bad. me. Damn. This is like a secret weapon. Hey, man. Like I said, well, like I'm going to say, karma's a, I mean, I karma's a, karma's a bitch. You want to do all that shit to everybody else? Look at karma buying your ass. That, that, damn, that, that's tough. Y'all, what can you really say about this, bro? He's trying to save his money. But I guess people are mad about this because of the fact that he's such a big flexer and stuff like that. He flexes his Lambos in his mansion. It's hypocritical if you're flying economy. But, like, hey, you can only flex so hard until you get a blood clot. So that's when you got to turn to Spirit Airlines. I think Jack's making the right plays and the right decisions. Y'all are just hating. Y'all are clowning Jack. That's right. I got the anti-take. Y'all hate this take. Y'all want to see this man bite the curb so badly, but I want to see this man serve the Lord. Yo! But if this is real, I guess he's just... Kind of laying in the bed he made. If you make content that's kind of on the degenerate side, you're going to have some dumbass fans. Y'all remember the Sneeko fans? And I know they're kids. I know they're kids, but these kids were saying, fuck the women, fuck the women. Just crashing out before they even get a chance to grow into their teenage years. Like these fans do not care. And I guess in Jack's case, this fan turned on him. Damn, bro committed a war crime. That's betrayal. Like you got to just think about that. A YouTuber having one of his fans turn on him. That's how you know you, damn, bro's really hated. Like, think about it. This man was really spotted on a plane by a fan who filmed his humiliation ritual. But if we're keeping it all the way of being, this kind of looks like some stuff that's staged and put together for content. It's best believe Jack knows that people that hate him bring him the most views. So filming himself in economy and like staging a fan spotting him on the plane, bro, that's realistic. He knows that's going to get views. I can see this totally being a fake video. Would not be surprised. Hey! the boy! Who the hell is that guy? I put a thousand dollars on this guy being a part of Jack Doherty's camp, bro. Cause ain't no way. Let's go. Who's trying to go to Coachella get lit tonight? <laughs> hey, hey, for tomorrow. Hey, enough, enough. Who's the fool are you for? <laughs> back home. I live in America. And I'm a motherfucking rock star, bitch. <laughs> Bro, if 
I was on this plane, I would crash out. I'd order like 37 rum and cokes. Guys, some guy tried to press me on the plane and try to fight me. Oh no! And look, now the cops are here for him. What? Ooh, sounds like a no fly list to me, huh? You're not fooling anybody. <laughs> this man is really staging plane stunts, annoying the hell out of everyone on board. And at a certain point, we gotta realize that this man is just toying with y'all in front of your face. People are calling him a clown on the internet, so he's gonna act like a clown. Free money for him, and it's also free real estate, quite literally. I just gotta say it, bro, to anybody that really hates Jack Doherty, bro, you can't hit the player, you gotta hit the game. He's bagging off y'all. The hater. The Jack Doherty bites the curve comments y'all he's making his guap and i guess the people online are finding their stupid person to laugh at it all makes sense kumbaya but he's kind of smart because he's bagging off of all of this but at the same hey hey i ain't gonna lie he is if you really if you really sit down and analyze it dude is doing what y'all hate him to do and y'all steady going back to watch it to you know comment all the hate me personally I just don't watch him. If you hate him that much, why watch him? If you hate him that much, why put so much energy into hating somebody? Because I'm telling you right now, if I hate him, I'm not going to put that much energy into him. But once I see that motherfucker, it's on sight. My money isn't everything, and eventually he'll realize that there's not much respect that comes with what he's doing. And then, maybe Jack Doherty will still have a turnaround. We never know. Imagine Jack Doherty. This man wants him to have a turnaround so bad. <laughs> That's the only thing he's been saying this whole video. Jack Doherty turn around. Jack Doherty turn You can't force nobody to change. You can only hope that they change for themselves. The Christian rapper, he starts spitting bars for the Lord. Come on, Jack, if you're watching this somehow, let's get it, bro. Because this shit... Uh, nah. The majority of stuff I see about Jack Doherty is just him putting out his rage bait content that just gets everybody outraged and mad. He's really got people out here commenting Jack Doherty versus Hydraulic Press like it's bad out here. But that's the real solution if you want to see bro stop acting like a clown and post rage bait. It's to not watch the rage bait he posts. Because if you watch it, he has successfully baited. Exactly what I just said. Congratulations. I gotta give him some credit though. Like, dude's a master instigator who found a way to monetize off instigating. And I don't like instigators. They piss me off, but clearly he's playing the game. I'm just wondering how long the cow's gonna produce milk for. How long's the channel gonna be popping off of this rage bait content? Because the more y'all watch Jack humiliate himself and act like a goof, the more he's gonna continue to act like a goof and not care and still make money. So, I don't know. I'm just wondering when the new arc is because this one's kind of getting old. Uh, it's not funny either, and it's honestly annoying, bro. Like, it, it is working with pissing people off. Because when I see Jack's content, it low-key pisses me off. Because it's like, who really wants to be bothered like that in public? That shit sounds annoying. I think the main reason why Gen Alpha watches him so much is because Shorts keeps recommending him. He's got a lot of mainstream Shorts content. So some people are, like, forced to watch this guy because of what their algorithm is like. Which basically just pisses them off every day because this guy does dumb shit. To those viewers, I pray for you, bro. Like, fix something in your algorithm if you keep Keep getting Jack Doherty. Now, when it comes to why I'm talking about it, we're just looking at goofy ass people doing goofy ass things. So, if you want to see more, then feel free to subscribe to the channel. Chat, was that smooth? I could see Jack Doherty blowing up again, to be honest with y'all, because this dude's really testing the waters in any situation. By this point, he's the human embodiment of fuck around and find out. We're just kind of watching from the sidelines. And I don't know, like, God forbid anything seriously bad happening to him. Like, I don't want this guy to go too far to the point where. You know, somebody draws a gun on him or a knife or something. Hey, only time will tell. I'm going to keep watching Ranko to keep y'all updated. And, um, yeah. Yeah, I'm not watching him. There's, there's no point. Oh, dang. Don't do it like that. Crazy. I know the internet's fucked up, so they'd love it. But let's keep it all the way real, y'all. If Jack got shot because of the things he was doing in public with people and he survived, bro, he'd be in the hospital bed like, yes, I got another banger. 10 racks from this video. Fuck a hospital bill. I'm good. We're so up, baby. I could see that being a realistic possibility, bro. But knock on wood, bro. I don't want to be the person that jinxes that. So I didn't say that. Hey, guys, Jack Doherty here. Today, I'm pressing the entire U.S. Army. 
Hopefully we can get a reaction. Like and subscribe, guys. Nah, but going back to what this video was all about, people getting mad at him for flying economy. I don't get that. I mean, sure, he's a flexor, but, you know, you got to save your money here and there. You can't always rent private jets. It's like $5,000 a flight or something like that. Most people don't get to fly private. That's like a luxury of a lifetime, bro. If I ever get to fly on a private jet, I'd have to get crossfaded. No exceptions. No debate. But, yeah. No gizzy. No gizzy. I get on in the fucking private jet. That shit ain't gonna be private. The public gonna know I went private. What the fuck are you talking about? But yeah, I'll say I ain't even really ain't really nothing to hate during this video. You know, it's just him being him. Can't really. Mm -hmm. The main thing y'all could do is just stop watching this content. Just every time you see something on dealing with him. Not interested, not interested, not interested until YouTube takes it off. Yeah, algorithm. Hey, the more y'all hate, the more he has time to create. But, anyways, it's your boy OGT Man, and I'm out.